Solvema presents Improvements in Grid Quality. Upgrade of positive grid quality by reducing the grain size. The best grain size is achieved by rolling lead strips at reduction rates greater than 85%. Research has shown that the strength of materials depends on the size of the crystals through a constant factor based on the kind of material used according to the following formula. During the grid manufacturing phase, it's very important to reduce the size of the crystals which form the structure to a minimum in order to improve resistance to corrosion adhesion of the positive active mass to the grid, endurableness in process handling. So Vema takes advantage of the recrystallization technique by rolling the lead strip in such a way that reduces the original thickness by upwards of 85%. As you will be aware, in the cold rolling phases, you achieve different effects on the crystal composition of the strip i.e. the first casting produces crystals whose size grows naturally by between 150 microns and 200 microns. The first cold rolling with a thickness reduction of approximately 30% extends the original crystals with no variation in their size. A deeper cold rolling of approximately 50% may stress the material and create new, smaller crystals, thereby starting the recrystallization process. Cold rolling, which reduces the original thickness by up to 70%, gives rise to a significant increase in the amount of new crystals generated by the mechanical effect. However, the only way to be sure the material will recrystallize completely is to choose a level of cold rolling which reduces thickness by upwards of 85%. The original 200 micron crystals are replaced by the new, smaller crystals whose size does not exceed 50 microns, which also gives the material an excellent level of mechanical resistance. So Vema suggests you start with a strip of this kind for the production of the grids in order to ensure optimum performance. This can be achieved using Sovema's strip production line, which offers a variation in thickness from 13 mm up to 0.75 mm, thus obtaining the following reduction percentage equals 